Oh, here he goes, here he goes, here he goes. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, no, he's coming. Wait, what the heck? Oh my gosh, it's all diamonds. Subscribe and slap the bell so you can turn on all notifications and never miss another video. One giant unspeakable house. One wild unspeakable. And one wild moosecraft. Hi, my name is Moose and I'm going to be showing you seven ways to steal your friend's diamonds in Minecraft. Woo! So you guys already know, if you have a friend that has a giant house built after them, you, then they're probably super loaded and filled with a bunch of diamonds. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to be showing you seven different ways on how to sneak inside. And my objective is to steal all the diamonds inside of this house. What are you looking at? Huh? Don't tell anybody. Big <laughs> Number one, the old-fashioned way. Just simply do this. Ah! Just run inside his house, go ahead and go all the way upstairs and find the secret stash of diamonds, grab it, and break out of a window. The simple way to do it, but if you get caught, you're not going to have a good time. <laughs> okay, perfecto. All right, where do we go? Perfect, there we go. 64 diamonds. And... Break this real quick. Here we go. Yes, got to go. Woo! Number two. Now, if you're a little bit more cautious, of course, and not like me, you don't want to be running inside and getting caught, of course, because then your friend is going to get super mad at you, and then he's going to go steal diamonds in your place. So just simply grab yourself an invisibility potion and become invisible with your pet sheep. There we go. Perfect, though. So now we can just walk around while Unspeakable does his thing, and we can simply find all the diamonds here. Okay, so where, if I was Unspeakable, where would I keep a secret stash of diamonds? Hmm, interesting. I see this diamond armor, but we need some more diamonds. Probably... Oh, there we go. The chest through. Perfect. <gasps> That's a lot of diamonds, bro. <laughs> this is amazing, bro. I'm gonna have so much big fist. And watch this. <laughs> Gotta go. Number three, just simply break through the wall and find the exact chest room. Now, you have to be very, very precise. And the best thing is, you don't even have to be inside of your house. Oh, there's a speakable game. Look at him. He's going upstairs. Okay, so we already looted two of his diamond stash rooms. Now, let's go to the third one. So, where exactly would he keep his diamonds at? Hmm, let's see. Um, usually people store things behind paintings, okay? He could probably keep some in the kitchen or maybe some in his closet. Yes! That's probably at the closet. Okay, so let's go behind this house, find the exact location of his closet, which should be right over there. That's gonna be about one, two, three, four, five, six. So six blocks, seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And right over here, this should be, oh, perfect spot. Look at this. There we go. Just grab the diamonds right here. 16 diamonds close it up and gotta go Woo! mission accomplished yeah and the best part is bro unspeakable has no idea at all and for everybody watching this video don't forget to subscribe slap the bell leave a like and comment down below on who we should prank next the fourth way to steal your friend's diamonds get yourself a shrinking potion and watch this boom now you're super duper invisible and the best part is you can actually climb walls look at that so now we're going to sneak inside of Unspeakable Gaming's house just like this. And now we're super small, so he can't even see us at all. Watch this. Look, we're going to hide behind slabs. And we're going to spy and see what he's doing down there. What, is, what actually is he doing? Huh. He's in the basement. So that's perfect for us. So let's look around. The diamond armor's over here. And he's got some enchanting. Wait, there's nothing in here. What? Oh, perfect. Got it. Some more diamonds. Easy, bro. And you're so tiny, man. You can go to prank him and even make a small little house inside of Unspeakable Gaming's house so he can never, ever find you again. Oh, um, this is a little bit awkward. Gotta go. Woo! Woo! Hey, remember, you saw nothing. What the flip? Who took my diamonds? Oh, I think he knows. Oh, snap. There he is. Look at him. Oh, no. Oh, he's going upstairs. He's going upstairs. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not good. So the fifth way to steal Unspeakable Gaming's diamonds is to simply get yourself a bunch of ladders. And I call this the Mission Impossible. So all we got to simply do is place down a bunch of ladders and build a way over to the top of his house. Now, if you see Mission Impossible, they, they tie themselves to a piece of rope and they find a way to go down in the bank vaults and stuff. And that's the same thing we're going to do today. I got to hide my diamonds in a better place. <gasps> There he is. Okay, so that should be his bedroom over here. Now, this is his bathroom. Perfecto. So, all we're gonna simply... Oh. Wait. I heard a chest. And I believe he's on the second floor, right? Or the third floor? Yes, he's on the second floor. Okay, perfect. So, all we're gonna do now is go over here into the bathroom. Just like so. 
and we're gonna drop down on a slime ball. Boop. Perfect. Got it. No sound at all. Gotta be super duper stealthy. Next up, open the door and go looking for those diamonds. Just try not to make any sounds at all. So I heard a chest somewhere around here. Ready? The less sounds we make, the better. Okay, so we're already in this bedroom. And I don't think any of his closets have anything inside. Let's look around. Nope, nothing here at all. And nothing here. Wait. Is that a chest? Oh, snap. There we go. Perfect. Try this out. Now watch this. Perfect. And what do we got? 35 diamonds. Mission complete. Now we gotta disappear before he finds us. Here he goes, here he goes, here he goes. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, gotta go, guys. Here we go. And perfect. Super duper easy landing. What the flip? And he has no clue at all. Gotta go. Why are there slimes in my bathroom? Oh, look at this dude. Oh, he had no idea. I don't know what he's doing at all, but it looks like he's working on something inside of his house. So what we're going to do real quick is create a distraction to mess with unspeakable gaming. And watch this. All we got to simply do is place down a bunch of different doors all around here. Just like this. There we go. Perfect. Now let's go ahead and put down a bunch of sheep inside of this weird looking door thing we just set up. Lots and lots of sheep, so they're super annoying and making loud sounds. There we go. Look at this, guys. Check this out, ladies and gentlemen. We need over 64 sheep in here, so they're super duper loud and unspeakable can hear it. And now the next step is to just simply do this. Ready? Place down a redstone comparator. Do something like this. Right click it. Then put down a lever. And it should create an automatic loop like so. Okay. And let's put this on every single door out here. Ah, look at him. Unspeakable's freaking out. He's like, what is that awful sound? Perfect. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. This should be just enough. So while he's distracted, we're going to sneak inside of his house and steal his diamonds once again in his secret stash. So let's go invisible. Let's become super small. And now we have a huge advantage. And we're going to go in from the back of his house right over here. Perfect. There we go. So while he cleans up the mess, we got to find another secret stash. And like I always said, guys, always check the paintings. I know how people are, bro. I keep all my stuff behind paintings. So trust me, I can relate, bro. Let's find every single painting inside of his house and see if we can find a secret chest. Nope, nothing at all. What about over here? Nope, no paintings. No secret stuff. What about his bedroom? Nope. Hmm. Oh, right here. Still nope. We got two more paintings right over here and right over here. Perfect. Oh, that's a big one too, bro. Yes, got it. 24 diamonds. Mission accomplished. Now simply break the wall once again and leave the house with no evidence. Woo! Yo, look at this dude. He's still trying to break all the doors and get rid of the sheep. What's he doing? Look at him. Look at him. He's going down. Wait, what? I'm telling you guys, every single rich person in Minecraft, they always have a bank ball full of diamonds. Now, he's been down underground his base for about an hour or so. So, I'm just going to take a wild guess and say he's probably got a secret stash of diamonds underneath there. So, ladies and gentlemen, get rid of your old diamond pickaxe. Talk to the Moose Mo guys by subscribing and get yourself an ultimate pickaxe from the Moose God's Pickaxe. I'm breaking 9,999, Fortune 3, and Efficiency 9,999. So with this thing, you can pretty much break everything that includes solid blocks. Like that, instant, perfect. So I'm not sure what he's doing. Oh, look at him, he's placing down a door. Oh boy, he's got no clue what's about to hit him, bro. So like I said, I'm not sure exactly what he's working on at all, but from what it looks like, he's building a secret entrance into his underground lair. Or his bank vault. Oh, there he goes. Look at him, he's right there. Yo, he's got no idea what's about to hit him, bro. Oh, there he goes. Oh, snap, we're still hiding. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's go and break inside of his bank vault. Here we go. Boom, instant break. Watch that. Now let's cover it up so make it seem like, wait, what the heck? Oh my gosh, it's all diamonds. Yo, what in the world is this? A giant diamond bank fall. Now this is what I'm talking about. So go ahead and use your pickaxe. Break everything there is possible here. Take it all, bro. Take all the diamond blocks. Woo, let's go. Oh wait, it says, um, it's Moose Crab has made an advancement. Oh, this is not good. Oh, snap, this is not good at all. Moose, uh, no, I'm not, I'm not doing anything at all. Whatever you do, just do not come downstairs. Oh, no, 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 come on, come on, let's grab all the diamonds, let's go. Yes, yes, yes. 
Oh, he's coming downstairs. Oh, he's coming downstairs. We gotta go. Run! Yes! Secret escape plan. Go, 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 go. This is insane, bro. This diamond pickaxe is absolutely crazy. Everywhere you go, it breaks things. And just like that, cover up your path and get out of here with a bunch of diamond blocks. So ladies and gentlemen, that is seven ways to steal your friend's diamonds in Minecraft. I hope you all did enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe, slap the bell, leave a like. Let me know who I should troll next. And I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Peace. Oh, no, he's coming. Oh, no, 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 no. Chill, 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 chill. chill.